welcome to Prime Gets Fit Yoga. I'm Johanna, your instructor. Let's breathe in. We'll start warming up. Exhale and roll the shoulders up and around. Good. Inhale. Exhale. Make sure you lift your feet up and spread out your toes and find that ground with your all the four corners of your feet. Inhale, exhale, roll the shoulders. Good. One more. Up. Now stretch over to the side. Good, other side. Little stretch here for the sides. Nice, and lift the arms up, lift your heels, stretch all the way up. Good, circle arms through, sit back into chair. Come back up. Circle arms through, sit back into chair. Warming those legs up and up. Circle through, chair, hold, belly in, draw your stomach in, lift the arms, feel the stretch. Good, inhale up, exhale, fold all the way over. Hands on shins, lift the chest to flat back. Good, and fold over again. Inhale, coming up, press up, lift those heels, finding your balance. Breathing, always breathing. Lower your heels, circle arms through, chair position. Come back up and fold over. Lunge right leg back, twist toward the front leg. Good, step back to downward facing dog. Come forward to plank. Lower to the ground, lift your back, lift your upper body up to lengthen and stretch out your back. Good, lift up again. Good, warming the low back, lift and lower. Good, tuck toes under, press back to downward facing dog, lunge your right leg in, all the way in, twist. Good, and lower the arm. Step the front foot back to downward facing dog again. Come forward to plank. This time lower into crocodile. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale back. One more, plank position. Exhale, inhale up. Exhale back. Nice job, come down to your hands and knees. We're gonna do opposite arm and leg. Reach out. We're gonna take the elbow and knee in and back out. In and out. In, out. Keep breathing. Two more, in, out, in, hold, hold here. Now go to your diagonal with the arm and the leg. Feel the work in the low back, all up the back, back to the center and down. Good job, other side, opposite arm and leg, holding. In, elbow and knee, out. Good, two more. Breathe. Holding. Working our core as we take our leg and arm to the diagonal. Back to the center and down. Good job. Press up to downward facing dog. Lifting up the right leg. Coming into a plank. 
we're going to take the knee and draw it toward the elbow and then back in and back One more. Good job. Now take the leg back up in three-legged dog. Good job. Lower the leg. Lift the other leg up. Come into plank. Knee comes toward the elbow and back. So the knee comes outside and straight back. You want to stay in plank position with your body the best you can. Two more. Sweep the leg up and lower it. Good job. Press here and down dog. Lift the hips, lower the heels. Hands are shoulder width, feet are hip width, and breathe. Good job. Come to plank position, lower all the way down to the ground. We're going to lift up and lower. Good job. Hands reach out. We're going to lower and lift. Upper locus, lower, lift. This is strengthening the muscles that run up and down along the spine. It's just like a back extension. Hold it up, arms front, bring the hands by the chest, elbows tucked in, press up. Good, and lower. Good, arms and legs lift, lower, arms and legs. Hold up, arms forward. Hands by the chest, lower your feet and press up. Good, and down. Come over to your back. We'll work some abs. Starting with the soles of the feet together, arms overhead, crunches up and down. If you need a support for the head, Put one hand behind. And breathe, exhale as you crunch up. We'll do a few of these. last one good hug the knees in opposite arm and leg reach out to the middle out in out in building our core strength is very important to our health in many ways so we need to work the middle that's what holds us up few more. Out, in, breathe. Good. Knees in. Hug those knees in. 
Feel the stretch in the low back. Good, now we're gonna take both legs out, arms around to the back and around. Hug the knees in. Out and around. Hug the knees in. Keep the belly nice and tight. Press your back into the mat. Don't hold your breath. Out, around. Good. Let's do two more. Nice job. Hold those knees in. Now lower the legs, feet down. We are gonna cross one leg over. We're gonna do a cross crunch down and up. Just a few. Now we're gonna do a double crunch. Lift the legs, crunch in. Keep going in and down. Last one, good. Lower that foot, cross the other leg, cross and down. All right, ready for the double, lift, and lower. Now this is fairly advanced, so watch your back on this one. Make sure you're exhaling as you come up. Two more. Good, knees in, and we're gonna roll up to seated. Feet together, soles together. I want you to sit up tall through your back and stretch here. Now I want you to come into a boat position, okay? Holding. Now, if you need to, go here for a little more stability. Two more breaths. Good job. Stretch here again. All right, lengthen out your legs. Inhale, arms up, exhale, folding over. Good, hands back. Fingertips point toward the feet. We're gonna lift. Our hips up to incline table, holding. Good, lower the hips, inhale, arms up. Exhale, folding over and breathe. Good, draw one foot to the inner thigh. We're gonna reach the opposite arm up and come over.
switch to the other side. Arm comes up and over, hold. You don't have to collapse into the stretch. Just press through your low back. Breathe. All right, good job. Come over to hands and knees. Press up to downward facing dog. And bring the, the right leg in for pigeon. We need to get a pigeon in today, so let's fold over. Flex your front foot, lengthen your back leg and stretch on the right side of the hip. This hip turns over the best you can. Release that hip. Good. One more breath. Good job. All right, back to downward facing dog and we'll just simply go to the other side. So this is a big knee bend right here. So we need to flex the foot to protect the knee joint. Lengthen your back leg. You don't have to fold over. If you don't want to, you can stay upright and just focus on that hip on the left side. Square in the shoulders, breathe. a really good hip stretch. Two more breaths in and in. Good job. All right, take this back to downward facing dog. All right, we're going to do a plank. So come forward to plank, lower into crocodile. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale back. We do a lot of these. Again, plank position, inhale, exhale, crocodile, inhale, upward dog, exhale, back, good, come to hands and knees, arch your back all the way up, and lower it, so we're swaying the back now. This is cow position. Cat position is with the back arched up. And down, good, have a seat. We're gonna stretch our necks out again before we relax. So holding this position, lower your chin. Let the weight of your head stretch out the back of your neck. Good, lift. Take the head over to one side. So focusing on the neck muscles. up over to the other side gently circle head down in front stop at the shoulder circle back and stop and head up good roll to your back So we are going to relax now. Arms out, stretch, palms up. Legs can be extended, or you can do this if you like. It's up to you. You can lay on your side. Just relax. Two minutes. Deep breaths. Let your shoulders drop. 
On your next exhale, let your spine completely relax. I want you to drop your jaw and relax your face. Soften your eyes. Relax your brow. And breathe into your belly. Reach your arms over your head, stretch all the way out. Extend your whole body out. Bring one knee in and across. Take your head and look down the back arm. Bring the other knee in and across. All right, bring both knees into the chest. We're going to circle them around. Go the other way around. Good. Gently come up to seated. Whew. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's session with me. I enjoyed teaching you. I hope that you use yoga uh, to de-stress after a busy day. I hope you use it to be more mindful of your body and body awareness. Be grateful for your life, breath, and your abilities. Namaste. Thank you for coming.